What's up gamers, Jem here, and welcome to my Stadia APK 3.9 teardown. First things first, I want to thank the community for reaching out to me and one specific person who gave me the latest version of the APK. I wanted to credit them, but they wanted to remain anonymous. You know who you are, so thank you. Moving on, let's start with something that some people have been asking for. Touch controls, and no I'm not talking about virtual touch gamepad, that we already have. I'm talking about proper touch controls such as tapping, swiping or pinching just like a mobile game. I found the codes Play this game without a controller by tapping, swiping and or pinching the elements on the screen. Also another code that says Enable direct touch. And another code that says This game supports direct touch. In case this wasn't obvious, not every game will support touch, it is up to the developers to implement this feature. Thanks to Adam from Original Penguin, they noticed that Terraria has the touch controls in the game, but it isn't working yet. Perhaps we will see this feature working in a few weeks. Moving on to Android TV. There are a lot more Android TV codes. I found the codes, please install the Stadia for Android TV application install the Android TV app and then I found codes where if you can't purchase a game on Stadia Android TV then it will ask you to purchase on the website or mobile. Those codes are Stadia payments aren't working on this TV right now. Buy this in the Stadia store instead. And finally Stadia Party for Android. This is something we knew was coming since launch of Stadia, however I don't know what happened but late last year mentions of Stadia Party for mobile was removed from the APK and with APK 3.9 it is back so we can assume the development for Stadia Party on mobile has resumed, maybe even speculate that it might finally be coming soon. Thank you for watching my video, this is Jem and I'll see you on the next one.